Filing your personal property taxes could be quite complicated. Even the simplest errors can result in hefty penalties. Therefore, here are some steps to follow to make sure you can pay your taxes in full and on time. First, keep in mind that in all Missouri counties, personal property taxes are based on what you owned on January 1st. So, when you fill out your assessment form, you must think about where you lived and what you owned on that particular date. Missouri is a self-declaration state, which means that you're only allowed to be taxed on what you say you own. In other words, reporting such information is your responsibility and your responsibility only. The state cannot pull records to find out that information for you. If you own a car, boat, or anything else that's licensed or tagged by the DMV, the assessor will evaluate its market value. The assessment rate for cars is one-third of its value, so if it's a $9,000 vehicle, the rate is $3,000. That assessed value gets multiplied by the number of levies, school districts, and cities put together. The resulting amount will be what you see on your tax bill. To get an estimate on how much you owe, take a third of your property's market value and calculate what's 8 to 10% of that value, depending on your school district. If you have any more questions about filing your personal property taxes, contact your local assessor's office today.